Hey guys, what's up? Manas here and today we're going to be discussing this last problem. Okay, in level 1, it's going to be problem number 4 and it goes like this. The top view of a 75 mm long line measures 55 mm. The line is in the VP. Alright, the entire line is stuck in the vertical plane. Alright, uh, let's go ahead. It's one end being 25 mm above the HP. Draw its projection. Alright guys, so the true length of the line has been given as 75 millimeters and when you look at this line from the top it appears as a line of 55 millimeters that's why i've written top view length okay it has been kept in such a manner that it appears as 55 millimeters when you look at it from the top the line is in the it's one end being 25 mm above hp now let us say that end a uh, is at a height of 25 millimeters above hp so when you look at this line from the front, you're going to see this end A at a height of 25 millimeters above the XY line or above the HP. All right. Line is in the VP means that its top view is going to lie on XY line. All right. That's for sure. Just think about it i'm going to show you a pictorial representation of this condition um so this over here is uh, a line the true length of the line 75 millimeter long line and this line entirely lies on the vertical plane that's why you said when you look at this line from the top you're gonna see this okay the top view is lying on this xy line or the reference line so called now this uh, endpoint a is at a height of 25 millimeters and this can only be seen from the front so initially we have to start by drawing and for that we need to ascertain as to from which view we need to draw. So you can clearly see that the true length of this line can be seen from the front and hence you have to start by drawing the front view. And for drawing the front view you have this point A dash which would lie 25 mm above XY line and then at a certain angle theta. Do we know that angle? We don't. Okay. So what we'll be doing is uh, let us head straight to AutoCAD and I'm going to show you what could be done. All right, so we have this line over here, this endpoint A, 25 mm above, and this is going to be A dash, A dash, and this over here is what you call point A, and you can clearly see that this uh, top view length entirely lies on this XY line. This is how much? This is 55 millimeters. All right, now I'm going to draw draw a line over here, a 55 mm long line horizontally, and I'm going to where is it gone? 55 mm long line okay and i'm going to draw a vertical line i don't know how much long but i'll draw okay this over here is the top view final top view and i'm going to write here um point b you can you can actually compare these two figures this is a this is b 55 millimeters and then we've gone up ahead and from with a dash as center i'm going to put an arc over here in order to find this location of b dash uh, this arc is going to be having a radius of 75 millimeters so with a dash as center and with 75 millimeters as the radius i'm going to put an arc over here 75 as radius and this is going to be the arc let me do this again that's it guys okay so this over here is what you call point b dash fine and finally we have this line final front view that is a dash b dash and let us darken this this is going to be 30 millimeters and few other dimensions which are supposed to be provided in the equations um this is 25 and this over here let us write this as 55 simply 55 and this over here is a dimension which is called 75 millimeters the true length of the line which can only be seen from the front all right so that's it guys and uh, if you have any questions or doubts, you can write them down in the comment section below. That's all from my side. Thank you for watching. 